That's a solid pitch. Hello folks, I'm Scott Turner with Outdoors. I'm going to be your host on this adventure down the South Fork of the Salmon River here in Idaho. And we're going to get after some salmon. Now once you hit the Warm Lake Highway just out of Cascade, you're going to want to watch the speed limit first and foremost. My cousin's a cop up there and they watch this road like a hawk and they like writing tickets. Now there's some really cool features about this drive, but one of them that we love and always stop is there's a natural spring on the left hand side of the road right before Horse Thief Reservoir Turnoff. And it is delicious water, and you can drink it right out of the spigot. But don't let the beauty distract you too much because you'll miss this left hand turn. Keep going down the highway, you run into Warm Lake, but you're looking for Forest Service Road 474 to Yellow Pine. As long as you make this left hand turn, you have 21 miles of beautiful river to salmon fish. It's pretty easy to miss if you're not paying attention. And it is, when it says single road, it means single road, like to pass people. You have to like go off the side of the road. This thing is, <laughs> ever since I've been coming up here, it's been a one laner. So be very cognizant and uh, pay attention when you're driving this thing. And it looks like we're rolling up on the, there's a fishing game check station. Like they check everybody that comes through here. And this is it right here. This is gonna be set up so when we come back through, this is where they, do the official count. Check your salmon. Dang it! It was an epic fight. Hook came out. It was like a bleeding. I ate it in the river. Holy cow. I'll take care of this.
nice. in our brine for about two hours now. The brine was just brown sugar, some sea salt, and some water. And I had a fire going here in my little pit. Got some good coals going, putting some green alders in here, and it's smoking real good. So now we're gonna put it on these alder branches that I sit in there and smoking commence. Look at this goodness. salmon on the river. Hot this morning, made the smoker, kept the thing stoked all day. 
Holy cow. Chinook salmon are a marvel of nature. Largest species of Pacific salmon, sometimes also known as king salmon, springers, black mouths, chrome hog, and tai salmon. Many of these fish travel more than 900 miles navigating through eight dams, climbing nearly 7,000 feet in elevation in hopes of finding a date in a high mountain stream in Idaho. An incredible feat of endurance considering they haven't had a meal since they left the ocean. Once they reach the South Fork Weir, they are trapped in a holding tank and the natives are re-released above the barrier to complete their life cycle and the hatchery fish are transferred to the McCullough Hatchery for brood stock. And after such an arduous journey, I will never know how they have so much strength to fight so hard, but I feel so fortunate to catch these amazing creatures in such a beautiful place. salmon on a fly. I think it's a jack, but I don't care. <laughs> Never caught a Chinook on the fly rod. Always, always want to try it. Nobody's here. No better time. Oh, if I land this, I'm going to be stoked, folks. My first salmon on a fly, like, yes. My first Chinook, it's only a jack, but I'm stoked. Right in the mouth, like, that dude chomped. to keep it you know on the bottom and reeling in before it hits that rock because it snagged right in front of it. And I ran. Fish, fish, come back. Fish. Uh, <laughs> what is that? That's a that's a salmon. Oh no. really? Is it really?
that. Check for salmon. Yeah. <laughs> that's crazy, right? Yeah, that was crazy. That's just a little one. Yeah, that was a little one, but it was a lot. For hey, me. <laughs> you're on the board though with the salmon. Okay. Nice, let's get another one. All right. in the bottom of that thing. Oh yeah. I didn't oh. think to drink the juice. Right? Yeah. Campfire delight. Campfire delight. Oh my goodness. Mm. Take a chomp of that. Um. How amazing is that after a long day of salmon fishing? Oh so good. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, it's like the whole day just got complete like I can go to bed now and just know right. that there's nothing else that needs to happen. Yeah. There's like this literally day has just been pretty much perfect. Caught for salmon today. Yep. A little jack, but it's a salmon nonetheless. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We caught a big one. Smoked a salmon. We still got tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, we still got well for me, it's day five. So we got one more day. Hopefully a bunch of fish come in, in the morning. Bonk a couple, looking home. Folks, look at this hog. Oh my gosh. That's a big, big, big old male. The hatchery too, like he's so big. But that's a solid fish. fish. I have much further to go. I gotta get him right here. He's in big trouble. What the heck? Quick stop fish. They're still fighting this fish. All the way through that minefield, and he's still on.
Come on, big fella. I just want a picture. That's it. I've never chased from this far down the river before. It's such a big fish. Oh my gosh. I pray I can land this thing here. Like, I do not want to go to another hole. I'm going to be heartbroken if I lose this fish. I'm going to be so heartbroken. He is enormous. We go through the next rapids. I cannot believe this fish. This is insane. Gotta land this fish here. You guys, the next rapid. I'm, oh, I'm so far down the river. I chased this fish like 150 yards. And it's a monster. I know where they get their strength. This fish just keeps going. If I would have lost him, I would have cried. I would have full on cried. Oh, that's a big one. That's a big fish, folks. Holy cow, I chased this thing like 150 yards down the river. Man, my leader and my line held up and I cannot believe it. I went through so many rocks. That was insane. Oh my God, that's so much fun. I love these fish so much. And folks, I tell you, that was a workout. And uh, I really hope you folks enjoyed this video. This one was an awesome one to make. So many fish. And as always, I try and put hot links down in the video description down below for all the gear that I use. So you can find it easily on Amazon or Cabela's or wherever I buy this stuff from. But uh, folks, if you enjoyed the video, please subscribe, it helps us a ton. In the meantime, get through Cashy Soa somewhere out there. Thanks for watching, folks. <laughs>
What are you doing? <laughs> You're a hot mess. What the heck? Excitement. I thought you were making cake. Oh. I was building a cake over here. <laughs> I thought you were building a cake. It's like that was gonna be heavy. I apologize. I tied my camera to a tree. So every time a breeze comes through, you're gonna get some. Uh, yeah. Hell yeah.